What are the pros and cons of a Cappuccino Visa Latte? I'm sitting here in my favorite cafe in Portland, Oregon, contemplating this age-old question. I mean, when it comes down to Cappuccino versus Latte, we're essentially choosing between two pillars in the coffee world. And being a coffee aficionado, I've had my fair share of both. So let's break down the pros and cons of each to see where they stand. Cappuccino Pros 1. Balanced Flavors A cappuccino is like that jazz album with just the right amount of improvisation. It's typically made with equal parts espresso, steamed milk, and frothed milk, giving you a perfect harmony of richness, creaminess, and bold coffee flavor. 2. Textural Experience The froth on a cappuccino is like a fluffy pillow for your lips. It's a luxurious experience and not just a drink. That thick layer of foam makes the first sips feel like a coffee cloud is floating into your mouth. 3. Less milk For those watching their milk intake or calorie count, cappuccinos have less milk than lattes, making them a lighter option. This also means the coffee flavor is more pronounced, which is a big pro for coffee lovers. Cappuccino Cons 1. Temperature Sensitive Cappuccinos can cool down quicker due to the airy foam. If you're someone who nurses their drink, you might find yourself at the bottom of a lukewarm cup. 2. Not as filling. Due to the lower milk content, if you're looking for a coffee that doubles as a meal replacement, the cappuccino might leave your stomach growling. Latte Pros 1. Smoother and creamier. Lattes are the comfort food of the coffee world. With more steamed milk and a light layer of foam, lattes are creamier and smoother, like a warm hug from the inside. 2. Great canvas for flavors. If you're into flavored syrups or alternative milks, lattes are your best bet. They are incredibly versatile and can be customized to your taste profile. 3. More filling. Because of the additional milk, lattes can be quite satiating. They can hold you over quite well, especially if you're on the go and don't have time for a proper meal. Latte cons. 1. Diluted coffee flavor. The higher milk to coffee ratio means that the bold espresso flavor takes a back seat. If you prefer tasting the intricate notes of the coffee beans, this could be a letdown. 2. Higher in calories. It's the price you pay for all that creamy goodness. The extra milk ramps up the calorie count, so it might not be the best choice for those trying to keep things light. Whether you lean towards a cappuccino with its frothy texture and stronger coffee presence, or the creamy, subtle sweetness of a latte, it's all about personal preference. In Portland, with its rainy reputation, sometimes the choice comes down to whatever feels like the perfect companion for the weather. Bottom line, there's no wrong choice here. Both have their time and place. Next time you're sipping on one, just remember to enjoy the moment. Life, like a good cup of coffee, is meant to be savored.